Okay, so here we have a Sidewinder. This is, what is this, uh, July 14th, 2024. And he's actually doing the sidewinding for me. The snake is totally chill. I had to prod him with a stick a little bit to get him to move at all. He saw me coming and just kind of froze. But like, he's totally chill. I literally flipped him over with a stick and he just kind of rolled over, didn't even rattle, nothing. He's totally chill right now. Oh, now we have a toad. So yeah, these guys, they can kill you, but it's pretty rare. I don't know the scientific name. It's a Crotalus, I believe. Could be wrong. Um, obviously a pit viper. Let's see if I can zoom in some more. His tail's kind of damp right now, so it's not really doing the, uh, the rattling terribly good. I'll see if I can get him to do it. Whoa! Yeah, he's totally chill. He's not gonna rattle for us. Okay, well, I guess that's that. Not a very big one. Uh, we're wrong. That's the typical sidewinder movement right there. I stood up and he spooked. Um, here's a Sharpie for reference. That's the only really commonplace reference size, consistent size object I had on me. So, yeah, he's kind of normal size. They get bigger than this, but not a whole lot. So, yeah, I'm just gonna leave him be, let him go on his way. He tried to rattle a little bit just a moment ago, but it didn't really, uh, it just kind of made like a faint, weak buzz. And I think it's because his rattle's wet, but, they can really move when they want to. So, basically all the rattlesnakes I've ever encountered though have been totally chill. There's only one exception. Um, that was like two years ago. Well yeah, he's a nice little guy. So, I'm gonna leave him in peace and go on my way. So, bye bye. Oh wait, wait, I didn't take, I didn't say anything about like food or anything. This is Sonoran Desert. This is where they live. There's another damn toad. Um, and another one behind him. Jeez, okay. Sonoran Desert, normal, typical habitat. This is like creosote scrubland right here. We just had a really big rain and um, that he probably got flooded out of his burrow. That's probably why his rattle is all wet and not really working. Um, the rattle's made of keratin, just like our fingernails and um, hair and everything. And if you if you know when you get out of the shower, your your fingernails are soft; they're easier to cut and everything. So I think that's why his rattle's not going off like it normally would. So anyway, they eat lots of rodents and stuff. King snakes eat them. Roadrunners eat them. Owls eat them. Hawks eat them. Coyotes eat them. All kinds of stuff will eat these snakes. And they specialize in rodents, almost exclusively rodents. Things like pack rats and field mice and kangaroo rats and, you know, pocket gophers, stuff like that. Um, that's, that's what makes up the snake's diet. So, anyway, there we go. I think I covered him in general. So that's that. Bye-bye. Hope you enjoyed.